And now weather with Melissa Hackney on KPBI News 6, your news source for East Idaho. Good Wednesday morning. It's a beautiful start to the day. Temperatures around 43 degrees in both Pocatello and in Idaho Falls. We do have 20 mile per hour winds in Idaho Falls, so 21 in Pocatello, and those could continue to increase throughout the day. Now, taking a look at our satellite and radar map of the region, you can see we do have a lot of cloud coverage as well as a lot of rain and snow mixture that has headed our way and will be hitting parts of eastern Idaho throughout the day. I'll tell you about that in just a couple seconds, but current temperature are our highs today, 53 in Idaho Falls, 52 in Pocatello. So right around average overnight lows, though, are going to be slightly above 35 tonight in Pocatello, 33 in Idaho Falls. Now our precipitation levels since midnight. Both areas have been dry. Sunrise will be around 723 this morning. Sunset around 750 this evening. For the lower plain today, we'll have a 50% chance of rain showers with the possibility of thunderstorms later in the afternoon. Mostly cloudy skies with winds at 15 to 25 miles per hour. Gusts even higher than that. Those winds are going to be sticking around throughout the evening and even increase tomorrow. 52 for the high in both Pocatello and in Blackfoot. Then for the upper plain, 50% chance of rain. We're also going to have winds as high as 20 miles per hour. 50 in St. Anthony, 51 in Rexburg. And for the mountains and highlands today, rain and snow likely. Though the central mountains, it's going to be more hit or miss, about a 50% chance. 43 for the high in Driggs, 48 in Malad City. This evening in the mountains and highlands, 50% chance of rain and snow. Overnight lows, 25 in Island Park, 29 in Arco, 30 in Salmon. And tonight in the lower plain, 40% chance of rain and snow. Mostly cloudy skies this evening, 35 in Pocatello, 34 in Blackfoot. And for the upper plain, they'll also still have a chance of rain and snow this evening. 31 in St. Anthony, 32 in Rexburg. Now for tomorrow's forecast in the upper plain, rain and snow likely. Like I said, those winds are going to continue to increase between 20 to 25 miles per hour. Gusts over 35 miles per hour. So definitely going to be a windy day. 48 for the high in St. Anthony, 51 in Rexburg. And for the lower plain, rain and snow likely. They could have gusts of wind over 45 miles per hour. Daytime highs around 48 in Pocatello and in Blackfoot. They'll also have a possibility of thunderstorms throughout the day. Then for the mountains and highlands, rain and snow likely. Daytime highs will be around 41 in Driggs, 44 in Malad City, 51 in Arco. Now taking a look at our Pocatello six-day forecast, you'll see that we'll dry up on Friday with partly sunny skies, a high of 54 degrees. On Saturday, mostly cloudy skies, a 40% chance of rain, warming up to 59 degrees. We'll still have those clouds on Sunday with a 40% chance of rain and snow, a high around 53 degrees. And for Idaho Falls, six-day forecast also will be clear on Friday with partly sunny skies, high at 53 degrees. 57 on Saturday with a 40% chance of rain showers, cooling down to 51 on Sunday with a 40% chance.